Hey guys, this is Pencilless Stuff and Zodiac Theory. Coming at you for my next Let's Play for Alm as I decide to just invite him on this journey because, you know, I can. Yeah, this Mother 3 is uh, great and you're getting a lot of background noise. The world must hate you. Oh my gosh, I forgot to close my window. Ah, you can talk to them for now. Okay, guys, uh, yeah, again, it's Zodiac Theory. A few things about this game there's a lot of Easter eggs, which I will, which if, uh, Taylor or Pencil of Stuff doesn't know, I will be helping them in. Uh, as you know, this game comes from Earthbound, uh, it's, uh, but it should be, it actually should be for the NES, but it came out for Game Boy Advance for actually, a lot of reasons. Actually, it came, no, actually it was supposed to be on the N64, but, uh, the oh, yeah, production right. shut down, so they just kind of went to the GBA. I think they should do a, make another one for, like, the DS or something, because these games are awesome. Yeah, so, they're very they're very well made. Even though it's on the, the Game Boy Advance, it has a lot of really great sprite animations, really great cutscenes. Yeah. It's just a very beautiful game. Yeah, beautiful. I'm just choosing all the uh, defaults. The defaults. Like, what's your favorite thing? I'm gonna go with love. Focus cut. Yeah, Focus and cut. this will actually all add on to the game. Yeah, like so. love is your special attack. Omelets, like your favorite food. Yeah, but, but you can do the whole Pokemon thing where you can say, like, penis, and your mom will be like, Hey, I made some fresh penises for you. Or babies. Yes. <laughs> babies work, Well, too. uh, yeah, I'm not gonna ruin that for you. Yet. Well, okay, is this well, okay? Is this okay? Does that look okay to you? Well, let's go over the family first, so people know who's this. Okay, for the main part, you'll play as Lucas. Actually, for the main part, you play as Flint. For a majority. But there is, oh. you do switch characters throughout, because there, yeah. there's many chapters, uh, chapters in this. But I well, think let's we'll get go into that later. For now, let's just start. Well, well, I was gonna go over the family, but yeah. Well, is that okay? Yeah. Well, let's fade the black. Welcome to the world of Mother Three. It, you should dude, do this music. Hey, I, 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 this game has beautiful music too. Hey, look, it's Skyrim. No, Camry, I would be, uh, no, that doesn't look like Skyrim, there's not enough snow. Uh, oh, oh, and there's no shouting! No. Nowhere! No, islands. islands. I like to say Isles, because it sounds fancier. Yeah. Uh, meanwhile, on Dragon Ball Z, planet Amic. <laughs> Space Where? Aussie, Space Australia. <laughs> Let's see, uh, cutscene to a nice, beautiful house. Tasmala, Tasmala Village. Um, however, this game does, uh, it, it, it takes place mostly around one certain place, and that's like the uh, area you started, it takes place there, but like you can unlock different places to go that allows you to uh, go further on in the game. And there will be uh, some points where we do a lot of grinding. Yes, but, uh, I love cactus. Cacti. We'll all, we'll go to all these places throughout the game. Hey, look at Coca Co. Coca it's just a chicken, and that's a cow or an oxen, and that's a pig. They're just regular farm animals. Oh, so no Coca Co. Coca Co. No. Home of Alec, Nawa's father. Yes. Knock knock knock. I knock 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 knock. Knock. You knock on wood. It actually sounds really cool. Wake the fuck! How come every great game ever made has the hero sleeping? Because Taros get tired. Lucas, how are you gonna sleep? Get up so we can play. Get up already. The dragons brought their babies over. They're really cute. Hurry up. I'm gonna have to do some of the voices. Yeah. Like the uh, old guy. But look, he's a super saiyan. Look, look, he's our. Wait, wait, wait. Go back upstairs. Go back upstairs. Nice thing to look at. Go in the mirror. No, I know, me. I know. I'm gonna, I, I know. It says you look messy, but I'm gonna do when you get your clothes back on. Yeah. That but, but actually shows the reflection. I know. I know. I'm gonna. I'm gonna be look. She, see, you're looking at yourself. I know. That's why I changed my clothes. Cause, but look what happens if you click A. Looking handsome. Yeah. Any other guys who come to this house and do that will uh, all say the same thing. Looking handsome. But Bes besides uh, Flint, he said something different. No, Flint says looking handsome. I played as him. It came here. Right. Okay. Well, there. There's old Uncle Pete. His name is Alec. There you go. Well, you do that voice. Oh, you're up, sleeperhead. That's his voice. Well, today's the day you head back home. I'm gonna miss you guys. We, we went fishing and hunting, and you helped kill a pig, and I'm gonna miss you. Hey, it's a frog. I'll do this. The stories with series with memories. Memories are remembered with other memories. 
and in turn become memories themselves. If you don't take care to preserve your memories, you'll forget them. So please, tell us frogs your memories and memories of everything so far, Ruben. That's what we prefer is saving. Now then, save your game. Uh, yeah, I, I think we should do that. Taylor? Yeah? Been full of stuff. I think this frog invented the Animus. The Animus? From Assassin's Creed? Yeah, I know, I know, I know. Why? Because memories within memories, that's kind of how the Animus works. That's also how uh, Kingdom Hearts works. Yeah, he... Wow, that was mean! Not really, it's a freaking dinosaur. <laughs> it gets back up, it's a freaking dinosaur. <laughs> <sighs> Ooh, I'm beat. I've been play fighting with the dragons all morning. We should play too, Lucas. Yes. Here, try ramming into a drago. Plow. Oh, here, there's the voice. You do it. Uh, uh, the old Lucas. guy. Yeah. Lucas still doesn't know how to ram into them things yet. Lucas! Try to imagine a thing called the B button. And, and then hold that B button for a second, then let go. Doing this will let you dash. And by using this dash ability, you can ram into a drago there. Also, you can use it to make babies. Klaus, show them how it's done. This music's really nice. <laughs> Did you know you can dash to make babies? Yeah, I know. There, yeah, just like that. Now it's your turn, Lucas. Give it a try, because I like you to play with dragons, because it's safe. Ah, oh, your face, okay. Read. Your face, that holds true for anything. Just relax. Smoke some pot. Ram. Haha. -ha. I love the cute baby drago. It's so cute. You have this coming! That <laughs> <laughs> me. Oh, oh, okay, did. I'm not gonna go to him. Yeah, he looks kinda pissed off. The harder you uh -huh. run into him, the more dragos like it. Move it out of the way! Make room for the Great Mole Cricket! Huh? The Great Mole Cricket. Oh, is he like a god? No. He's the first enemy in the game. I can't just sit idly by when I hear someone play fighting. I'm gonna wipe the floor with all of you. Get in my way, you're in the world of pain. He reminds me of Krillin. Yeah, only he's less. Only I think he's even more useless. Yeah, you're. you're I don't know this guy's um beat, so I'm just. I'm just going to assume that he doesn't have one. Yep. I don't well, now that. as we watch two little kids kick animals around. <laughs> Look, ah, bit you! Wow. Now you, now you have like Lyme disease. Yeah, that's uh. That one. I guess I can now uh, explain it. There is something in this game called rhythm attacks. If you make put enemies to sleep, you can tell what their rhythm is, and if you hit the uh, A button to that rhythm, or the attack button to that rhythm, you will do combos and you'll keep doing damage. You can do up to 16. I think we have more of a spine than I thought. I just forgot what voice I was doing. If you like, I can train you personally sometime. Next time we meet, I'll be at a big, a big mole freaking whole stadium. I look forward to seeing you there. Bro. <laughs> uh, it's like a 10-year-old kid on Xbox. Yep. Yep. Okay, I'll do this voice. <clears throat> I stepped on a milk cricket. I hope it's alright. Yep, the manliest woman ever. Lunch is ready, everyone. I'm going to your favorite, boys. Omelets! Uh, Ooh, lunch, lunch, omelets! You too, Dad. Okay, I'll just go get my team cheers. Wait, wait, wait to read a lot right now. You're gonna have to read a lot. <laughs> now, the Taking big okay, what are, what are, listen folks, here's how to save. Talk to frogs, this is how you save. It's not too tedious, troublesome, so you should talk to frogs as often as you can. It should, uh, plus saving is absolutely free! Now then, it's time for me to return to the story. Phew, that was a lot. Hey, wait for me! You saved me some moments too, I hope! Oh. Yay! Fade the white? Fade from white, right? What's your favorite food, Mom? Ask your father! Oh, omelets. 
then your favorite is the same as ours. We make a good match. After we're done, either we need to get ready to go home. We have to go through the forest to get back, so we'll need to leave early. Don't be silly. I bet the kids can make it here on their own. It's that, it's that safe. I bet you could even handle it, Luke. I bet even it, uh, you can handle it, Luke. <laughs> I'm picking on the poor kid. Abuse. I'll read the, um, this thing is regular, not as a voice. Oh god, the sun's exploding. Oh wait, no, it's a setting. Dear Flint, just like you said, they were, the children have been running around the mountains and fields tirelessly since the moment we arrived. Klaus is a daring and Derek is as daring and full of energy as ever. While Lucas is still a bit coddled, but neither one seems tired of playing at all. My father seems sad to say goodbye to his grandchildren after seeing them for the first time in so long. But we should go. But we should be home by this evening. <coughs> I had forgotten how nice and refreshing the mountain air is. You're always covered in the smell of sheep, but back in Tasmillie Village, so I really wish you could have been there to take in the air. The next time we visit, let's, point, let's uh, ask one of our neighbors to tend to the sheep so we can all come up with here as family. Klaus, Lucas, and I were always thinking about you when we got home this evening. I'll start cooking some of your favorite omelets right away. With love, your dearest, Anawa. So, if they, if they eat omelets all the time, why don't they just raise chickens? They have chickens. Oh, well, well they take care of sheep. Well, I don't know. Shut no. up. <laughs> Do sheep lay eggs? I don't know, maybe. Oh, 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 a carrier pigeon. Holy crap. Did that come out of her shirt? Yeah. Oh, she, she's, she's like... Whoa, what's, this trying to mu what's this change in the music? What the heck? Where's Super UFOs. Smash Brothers Brawl going around here? <laughs> that was a UFO. I know. Uh, I, could... I, hope the, I hope the music's not going over my voice. Mother three. I think we're gonna end it off here. Okay. Bum, well, boom, boom, in a second. Okay, so I'll do your outros. And dun, thank you. Okay, stop <laughs> growing <the> music. <laughs> okay. No combo. No combo for me. No wombo combo for you. Wombo, the study of wombology. Okay, okay. Yeah, we're, we're just gonna have to endure this little cutscene before we can stop. Ooh. Terrorist attack. Hey guy has wood. I'll run for critters, run! Caribou! Like, uh, it's Team Rocket! And Pigmas Core. And hey, look, they're throwing Pokeballs! Those aren't Pokeballs. Those are Explody Balls. I told you it was Harris Attack. No one listened listen to me! I didn't say it wasn't. Why would they kill the trees? I don't know. They're obviously the main antagonist. That guy has awesome feet. Oh, if you, you chapter one, night of the funeral. Oh, foreshadowing. But um, uh, that guy looks like he has a hose. Oh no, that's just the uh, that's a siren. That's awesome. Yeah. No, no, no. Uh, I love how he has like, like a million legs. Look, look, look! It's a fire, a fire, a fire! The sunshine force is on fire! A huge fire and flaming fire! Fire. Good voice. Thank you. It's Chuck. Time to play as Chuck Norris. Well, guys, we'll end it off here. In the next episode, we'll play as this Chuck Norris-like character with that awesome hat. And, uh, we'll see you guys later. This has been Pencil Thanks. Stuff, and... Zodiac Theory. Waka waka!